abnormalities. You know them, you love them, and you probably love them a bit too much. Which is what I'm here to discuss today. I'm about to go through a bit over 150 different abnormalities throughout the entire Project Moon franchise with one goal, to determine exactly which ones get shafted and which ones get shafted. And I mean all of them. Lobcorp, Wonderlab, Runa and Limbus. I'm not discriminating here. However, one rule. I am not counting distortions and ego because they are more human than they are abnormality and I'll save those for another day. But for certain abnormalities, I will be taking ego gear into consideration. But before we begin, if you want to enjoy this video, please consider subscribing. My main goal at the minute is to get to 10k subs before the end of the year and any little bit helps. I truly appreciate it. But enough chilling. We have a lot to go through, so let's get started. Starting simple, with the very first abnormality in LabCorp, the standard training dummy. I mean, I'm sure you could find a way, or you could probably make one if you're that desperate, but we'll give it a smash. Good strong start. Second Amno, we're already at our first pass. Great. Is another strong starter. The main guy himself. I mean, looking at him, right, he's a decapitated floating head, which you could probably do a better call Saul episode one reference with him because he looks small enough, but man. Has it been 30 seconds yet? I don't know. Once in this fucking massive, dude. Like, this fucker is gargantuan. I don't think you realize how big he actually is. In Lobcorp, he looks fine, small enough, because he's the same size as the Nuggets, and the Nuggets are small. But then you play Runa, and you look at the card art. This dude is huge. And because of that, I'll have to give him a miss. Because it would be like trying to go at a massive boulder. Plus, all the religious imagery would probably give me a fast pass to hell, so, uh, pass. She is evil. She's manipulative. She's a complete drama queen who always makes herself the victim. I can smell the neglect and desperation for attention by just the way she dresses. And she's a complete bitch. I need her. Smash. Teddy bear. I wouldn't touch it because it's just that. It's a teddy bear. But it's aberration, on the other hand. And specifically, it's ego. Pass for this. I would smash for the aberration. Red shoes. I mean, how would you even go at this? I guess, you know, you could... I don't have a thing for feet ah! pass. Parisia. I mean, anything's in if you're brave enough. Oh, lady. Oh, my. Though so she literally gives you a revolver and tells you to kill for her? I'm not a buying this in, so I'd rather not feel her flapjack titties all over me. Pass. Ah! Nameless. Ooh. There's nothing I can say here that doesn't make me look like a Minecraft YouTuber. But he is one of my favorite abnormalities due to his usefulness. Hmm. Lady facing the wall. I mean, I literally have to censor her for YouTube. I don't find her that hot, though. Nothing there. Hmm. A question that I ask of many of these abnormalities later on is, like, where do we even begin? But seriously, where on his body would you start with this guy? I suppose he might start with you. A very, uh, unsure smash. C3 stuff for more info. Big nothing there. What a hunk, am I right, ladies? 1.76 megahertz. I, I, how would you even? <laughs> I'm not gonna question it. Pass. Ah! Singing machine. It's a meat grinder. It's a literal meat grinder that will pulverize you before you feel anything. But I already sand the cannibal ladies and ruin us up. Let's go. Smash. Silent orchestra. It's a mannequin. What? You could probably make a way if you use the drill. But like in game, you'd probably just steal all your energy and then dip before breakfast. So. Ah! Woodsman. You see, Woodsman, his story is really depressing because he's a machine that was built by humans who has to kill other humans against his best judgement just so he can have a chance at getting a heart. And most people also work on him once and then never go back to him so he's there by himself the entire time. To be honest, I'll probably just cuddle this guy and try to make him feel nice and wholesome. So here's a new counter just for Woodsman. Poor guy. Cuddle. Ice Queen. I'd be afraid of making a shish kebab out of myself if she turned around too fast, so uh... But she'd also probably fight me to the death as her own idea as one-on-one -on -one time. Ah! Ass. Big bird. Very fluffy. Very big. But unlike one sin, I wouldn't be scared of cracking my skull open on him. But I would be afraid of poking one of his eyeballs out. So careful smash. Reddit. He's a literal multi-tool who was designed to help humans. And he inflicts severe pains on humans as well. Smash. Like, is there a question here? Snow White. Now, I ain't touching Granny Smith with a 10-foot pole, not even Ebony Stem, but I can make an exception for the ego. So pass for snow, smash for Ebony. Spider-Bud, not a shot. 
And it's not because I'm arachnophobic. No, not at all. So I don't want to take responsibility with the kids. Pass. Beauty and the Beast. I mean, it would be an experience, all right. It's probably not an experience I want. Especially if they're gonna look at me with all those beady eyes. Ugh. Pass. Plague Doctor and White Knight. Now, on one hand, Plague Doctor looks like a nice, well-dressed gentleman that would bring you out for a lovely dinner and treat you to the best night you've ever had in your entire life. But then he takes the cloak off and he's that. Uh, no. No, thank you. Pass for both. The button. Please, please, do not push the button. Oh, it's gonna be a white Christmas up in here if you know what I'm saying. Way. Queen B. Now her head is shaped like a cheese grater, and I said no to Spider Bud because I don't want to take care of her kids. But I feel like Queen B might put me through enough pain where the kids have to take care of me in ER instead. So, smash bloodbath. She's evil. She's manipulative, she's a complete drama queen who always makes herself the victim. I can smell the neglect and desperation just from the way she dresses, and she's a complete bitch. Smash. Well, cheers. You can get double teamed by the island boys and get free drinks for life. Sign me the hell up. Double smash. Alarun. Nah, I shouldn't. I really, really shouldn't. But I need, I need to know what that tongue does, bro. I'm also only realizing now while I'm recording this that she has six legs. I always thought she had four. I don't know how I didn't notice that. Anyways, very shameful smash. Forsaken murderer. He's just a guy. He's just a really sad, immensely deranged guy. I mean, I probably just play a few rounds of Melts Blood with him, to be honest. Ah! Child of the Galaxy. One of my most hated abnormalities. I'd love to smash his head against a wall, but that's not the kind of one we're talking about. So, definite pass. Ah! Punishing bird. Bro opens up into like a seemingly infinite void of just razor sharp teeth. And he's super naggy and needy, but unlike a certain orchestra, he won't up and leave after saving all your stuff, so smash. Red Riding Hood. She's cool as hell. She's strong as hell. She's probably mean as hell too. She's super swagged out and jerked up, as well as wielding some of the sickest weapons in the entire franchise. And she has the coolest Admiral fight in Runa. I mean, is this even a surprise? Smash. Corroboration though, the blue hooded guy gets a pass. He's just, he looks kinda weird to be honest. Big bad wolf. No. Fragment. I think it's physical, is it? I don't know. The bones will probably pierce your brain and kill you anyway, so... Uh, ah! Crumbling armor. I mean, I guess you could just wear him. I mean, you'll technically be inside of him, so... It works. And you get a cool curse, too. And he's super loyal. He won't let you talk to any other abnos. Smash. Judgment bird. What the fuck are those legs, bro? Ain't no way I'm gonna have anything to do with these rickety-ass trigonometry graph-looking legs. Get out of here. Pass. Ah! King of Greed. She's hot as hell. Show me what that mouth do. Smash. Little Prince. Uh, are the heads at the bottom where you're meant to go at? I don't know. I'm just gonna say a quick pass. Yeah. Get out of here. Laetitia. Fucking pass. What did you expect? Funeral of the Dead Butterflies. He's a Tumblr sexy man wannabe. Very stylish and has one of the coolest egos. With five arms as well, so he'd be quite flexible, I'd say. Smash. Your fry shoots. Look at my profile picture. Now back to him. Now look at my Nugget Gregory. Now back to him. Yeah, no surprise here. Uh, he'd even hook you up with a post to smoke, so... Smash. BTS. Not a hope. Pass. Dreaming current. Like Woodsman, he has an absolutely depressing story, so I do feel bad for it. But, uh, I, I wouldn't cuddle that, I'm sorry. Pass. Burrowing Heaven. Staring contest time. You could probably do some nasty stuff with those tendrils, but you could at least romantically stare into each other's eyes for all of eternity. Curious, yet still careful, Smash. Night of Despair. Uh, I'm not sure where your face even like begins or ends, but you are pretty. Plus, I have an obvious affinity for face masks, so Smash it is. Naked Nest. I, uh, I, I genuinely forgot you existed before researching this video. I mean, you literally just give people infections and kill them, so no thanks, I don't want to get abno aids. Pass. Ah! Mountain of Smiling Bodies. Now, as much as I want to say pass, every time I see this guy, I just want to take a bite out of him. He looks like the, the candy monster from Gravity Falls. You know the one? Uh, it's in the Halloween episode and all the kids start eating him and he looks like he's made out of licorice and... I don't know, I bet Mountain tastes like licorice too. Smash. Shout and furrowed. Um... Just don't look at them, and you'll be okay. But there is a guy inside who could probably give you the goth oxy thousand. So, uh, luckily, my nugget is literally blind, so I'm a okay. Smash. Heart of aspiration. <laughs> Most of a crazed researcher. Paper cuts. Pass. Flesh idol. I mean, anything's a if you're brave enough. Smash. Giant tree sap. How would you even go with a bottle? 
Actually, please don't answer that. I'll figure it out myself. Smash. Mirror. But this one's for all the Dante simps. Just keep kissing its flat glass face. Eventually something will happen. Pass. Ah! Shelter. How in the goddamn do you do a room? Smash. Fairy Festival. They remind me the nymphs from Rayman, just uh, a million times less attractive. Uh, the attachment issues are way too strong with this one. I'll give it a pass. Ah! Meat Lantern. Show me what that mouth do. Smash. We can change anything. I mean, it starts slow and then it speeds up, so you'll get a good bit of pain before being pulverized. But I would probably only use it as a last resort if there's no other abno around. Uh, hesitant slash. Train to hell. Uh, we still don't know what lies behind those bars, but he has really big grabby arms. He could probably do something wacky with them. And the darkness of his cage would be a good place to hide, but uh... Fishing name as well, because that's exactly where I'm going after making this video. Smash. Scarecrow. He would be an absolute freak with those hands. I mean, he'll quite literally suck the life out of you. Smash. Refraction variant. It's thin air. Pass. It's got a, a really big mouth, I think. I mean, as a wise Kanye West one said. Well, I guess a blowjob better than no job. Censored. Well, I'm not exactly sure what it can do. Or what it is, for that matter. But we do know it can, in fact, reproduce. Smash. Now, I could have taken the easy way out here. I made a metamorphosis joke, but even I'm above that. Pass. Ah! This one really only depends how hot your co-workers are. Smash. Ooh, today's shy look. You see, in Ruina, the angrier the face, the better. So we know Shy Luck is a really feisty one. Uh, some may not like it, but it's a lot more like than half the literal inanimate objects we've talked about so far. Smash. Blue Sir. I mean, do I even need to explain? He's literally my favourite abnormality. My profile picture had a plushie of him in it for like over a year. He's my favourite A-lip and I literally have stickers of him on my PC. But I do need to clarify that what I said about shoes still holds true. I do not have a thing for Pete. So with that warning, Smash, you must be happy. I mean, like, it's as close to a pleasure machine as you're going to get. But uh, I think that's too easy. That's the coverage way out. Pass. Ah! It's a good spring. Pass. Ah! Like, what are you going to do in a magic eight ball? Probably a lot, but just keep that to yourself. Pass. Ah! I know it can suck weapons in, but can it suck people in? I'm pretty sure it can, so pass. Ah! Porcubus. This is another one where I just have to ask, where does it begin and where does it end? Absolutely not for the Avno. But, uh, oh. Man, that ego is something else. Smash just for the ego, though. I'm Irish, not English. Pass. Ah! Cherry Blossom. I mean, there is a hole if you try. Like, I'm not exactly going to go all Lorax on this thing, but... Uh, pass. Ah! Order of the Phoenix was the worst book I've ever read. It's the worst Harry Potter book by a mile, and that is saying a lot. Ah! You know, I'm not really feeling it. Pass. Ah! Yang, the same thing for this one. Pass. Ah! <laughs> uh, see, if you take the L out of its name, it says... <laughs> It says backwards cop. Il Piano de Luna. She is a hag. She plays piano. She wears fancy clothes. She gives one of the coolest ego in the game. Plays one of my favorite songs ever in Moonlight Sonata. And she's a hag. We cuddle hags. Cuddle. Army in black. You see, I actually own a pillow with this guy on it. It's on my bed right now. But I don't harbor any feelings towards it. I use it to rest my weary head. So, uh, sorry AIB fans, but pass. Ah! But, if it's any condolences, sniper rifles are fucking rad. I mean, there's one thing acting like a dog for a hag, but an actual... No, man, just no. Ah! Another case of... I mean, where the hell does it begin and end? Pass. Ah! Melting love. Wait, do, I, do I have to elaborate? Like, chugger. Smash. Clouded monk. You know, like Naked Ness, I genuinely forgot you existed until I made this. Um, and your second form definitely is a help in your case here, buddy. Pass. And last, but certainly not least, for the Lobcorp Agnos, we have the Bruce Willis maker itself. You are bald. But unfortunately, I quite cherish my long locks, so uh, I'll have to give a pass here. Spiral thingy, I forgot your name. You were just discount Rosie at Desire before Desire was even a thing. Pass. It's a, it's a house. It's a literal dollhouse. Like, I suppose you could, probably. Smash. White Lake. I mean, it's humanoid enough, and it has white hair. Those are literally my only two ones, so, uh, smash. Red Queen. Look at her eye, man. I mean, it's a really sick and underrated design, but... After seeing what can be unseen, pass. Uh, it's literally just hair. But, I mean, Ty does brush it with ease, so that means that it is well-kept and soft. So, uh, silky smooth smash. Scaredy Cat looks really cool, but it's also just still way too animal-like, so pass. And as for Road Home... Come on, man. Hookah Caterpillar, however you pronounce its name. 
Crow is cooked, high off his head and just chilling. Like, you'll be so off your rocker, it doesn't even matter that he's a caterpillar. Smash. Tears. It's it's literal cake. Smash. Servant of Wrath. Again, man, I may be Irish, but I'm not mini lad. Pass. I forgot you existed. And I forgot your name. But you also look pretty generic, so I'll pass. I'm not missing anything. Squid Games! Why is there so many? That is one creepy dog. Also, it's way too animal like for me, so pass. I mean, how do you even do a flower? I mean, to be fair, the pollen on a flower is literally its. You know what, so this probably wouldn't be too hard to do. Go ahead, smash. Everlasting Percy. Hmm. See, on one hand, I really like Alice in Wonderland, but this rabbit looks like Vanny, and uh, I really did not like Security Breach, so pass. Ah! Pinocchio. I mean, I don't know what to say here. He has an absolutely sick design, but he's horrifying, and like, him copying all your movements wouldn't be too, uh... I don't think it would end too well. Pass. Ah! Hammer and Nail. She's a little psychopathic, but that's cute. Smash. Ozma, where is its body? Uh, why are so many abnormal hair to make out just by looking at them? It, it's weird. Unfortunate ah! pass. She is such a bad bitch. Her outfit looks like Elena's blood suit, but just green. And like, this has got to be my most sure smash of this entire list. God damn. And no, it's for Atu. I mean, he's the closest thing to mommy. I mean, Elena on this list. So, uh, legacy smash. Jester of Nihil. He's probably way too nihilistic to have fun with. Like. You'll be having fun, and then he'll just remind you how love is a chemical reaction, and then he'll try to act above it, and then he'll just kill it. So, pass. Ah! The bongies. There is literally nothing in this whole franchise I hate more than Hell's Chicken. This isn't just a pass, ah! this is me punting them into the sun. The Doomsday Minion guys? Ah, oh, they're just like blood flesh things. Pass. Ah! Want to be beat hurtily? They're big muscly robot men, I mean, you want to get pleasure hurtily? Ah. Smash. See red shoes for more details. I don't have a thing for feet. Pass. Ah! Sick design, but I still hate Encorp unconditionally, so pass. Ah! This spider one, I actually don't know the name of this, but it kind of reminds me of Mimikyu. But uh, also much like spider, but I don't want to deal with the responsibilities of a family, so no thanks. Pass. Ah! I also don't know this guy's name, but he's a drinking buddy. You can get wasted for free. Smash. We are really, really scraping the bottom of the barrel here, huh? Pass. Ah! It's a red flower thing, but if you zoom in really close, you can see a small, tiny hole lined with razor sharp teeth. Smash. Right at his back. And now he's got those uh, vacuums instead of hands. I'm sure he could do his job well. Smash. Old man. Hmm. I mean, I'd listen to his stories gladly, but not a hope of anything else. Ah! Space orb, dude. I feel like this guy would make me question my own mortality too much, so... Uh, the six arms is better than two, I think. Smash. Very long legs. He with that fedora, he strikes me as a nice guy. Um... Smash, but I'll buy my own drink, thank you. Red Durfry. I mean, he's cool, <laughs> but that's about it. Take everything about Durfry and tone it down a lot, but still a smash. Homeward. That's a lot of heads. Enough said. There's a lot of Admos and Limbus that I have nothing to say about, and like this is one of them, so just... I'll go through a few of them pretty quick. Pass. 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 Smash. Pass. Pass. How even... Pass. Paper cuts. Pass. Hello, nurse. Smash. Pass. Pass again. Smash. Pass. Pass. Tin air. Go ahead. Nurse. Again. Smash. Pass. Smash. Looks like jelly. Smash. A dojin joke is still below me. Smash. And fuck this stupid fucking boss fight. Pass. Sunshower Wolf. Uh, way too animal-like. He's way too out of my alley. Smash. Talisman. It's just the wooden guy from Tekken. But timber is expensive, you know, so be careful around them. Don't break them. Smash. Bull. Oh, me these hot, what can I say? That was a really bad joke, I'm sorry. Ah! Very gentleman. It's not called fat. It's called love blubber. Smash. Pursuance. Mmm, stone tablets. No thanks. Ah! Crown of roses. Kinky. Smash. The clam? I am sort of leaning towards yes, but it's kind of complicated. I just hope it doesn't krill me. Smash. White G, posium, blah, 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 however you pronounce it. I'm pretty sure this guy is made of cotton. Cotton makes jumpers and sweaters. Sweaters are comfy. And uh, that means this guy's basically just a sweater, so definite smash. Dimension variant? I mean, the fact that I even have to center this guy's chest for YouTube speaks volumes. Smash. Phantom Pain. What a feel. It's a goddamn tree. 
I mean, how many fucking tree admirals are there in this franchise? Gah! That little crying bastard. Chi Chan, I'm so sorry. Great coat. I mean, bro came packing. Treat him well, keep him loyal, and you'll be protected for life. Smash. Roaring heaven again. See, I'm counting you separately because now you have a body, but the same thoughts still apply. Smash. Danger, danger. Gah! Wedding. NTR. Pass. Gah! Backwards clock robot. See, I'm gonna take this as a chance to point out how cool this guy looks. I mean, you really don't get a chance to take in the event out in this game, just because of the shitty filter over it, and you're always trying to rush through your mirror dungeons, but... Let's take a second to look at it. That is really cool, Eric. But there's still a robot pass. Blumpster. You're not the guy. You're a mere imitation of our Lord and Savior. However, your eagle gift is a literal godsend, so... Smash. Oh, robot nothing there. Just make sure he doesn't overheat. Smash. Girl with doll. Why is there so many young abnormalities? Pass. Ah! Doomsday calendar. It would literally have to be the end of the world before I gave him a chance. Pass. Ah! Apple. I mean, Yuri was really cute, so. Smash with her in mind. Rolling bald creature think. How? Pass. Ah! Small G posseum thingy. Cotton comfy. Sweater comfy. You get the point. Smash. Stick bug. I'd probably snap it by accident. Pass. Ah! So this is Baba Yaga. I know it's a whole ass house, but this is the only sprite foot, and I think it's pretty funny, so. Ice cold. Smash. Nothing there, creature thing. Its mouth opens up with two hands. It's probably very versatile. Smash. Torture wheel. Testicular torsion. Pass. Ah! Whatever this is, literally just jelly. I mean, it would feel like something, alright, but still better than most, I'd wager. Smash. Chromer. Now, I will die on this hill that this is a distortion not an abnormality but just to play devil's advocate for this video i'll say that she is an abnormality and if she is then it's a smash i despise regular chromer but uh i mean this is salt mouse man and corp inquisitor fuck bone blast fuck these guys too not in a good way Pass. snake arms rad the only end corp pug i actually like so smash funeral aberration probably not as classy as the original but i'd still give him a go smash junk crab Sure, smash. Mother junk crab. Definite smash. And last, but certainly not least, an abdo that I despised but has grown on me very hard, Headless Itchy. Smash. And with that, we're done. That was a... Uh, that was a lot more than I thought. Now, I didn't count them while I was recording, but the exact <laughs> number should be on screen right about here. I do feel like I might have missed one or two abnormalities, but if I missed them, then they really don't ah! matter. But, uh... If I did, I'll make sure to include him in the Inevitable Ruin guest list that I do. The uh, the only one I'll actually do anything with is Woodsman. I just want to hug him and tell him it'll be okay. But um, other than that, my good buddy pal Sunil is doing his very own list on this as well. So if you want to see his objectively worst takes, then you should check out his video too. The link will be in the description. But anyways, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, please consider subscribing. It genuinely helps more than you think. And uh, leave a like and tell me what you thought in the comments below. Is there any abnormalities that you'd uh, give the time of day that I'd rather not? But with that, I'll see you in the flip side.